everybody and welcome back to my channel and back to the Parenthood Let's Play. I feel like it's been like eons since I've done this, but it's been about a week, I'm pretty sure. I had to actually go back to my notes and see what happened in my last episode, but um, yeah. So I think in the last episode it wasn't too thrilling. Um, we had invited Brian over for coffee and she had opened up to him about her uncertainty with the future of her marriage and her husband's stress level. And um, <clears throat> Brian met Aiden for the first time and Aiden wasn't very nice to him. And then Brian was having some sort of love party or something in his apartment and Aiden had to go over and shout at him for that. So yeah, so their friendship is probably on the rocks. But um, I'm sure her and Brian will be fine, but I'm not sure that Aiden and Brian will be fine. So with that being said, I think I also mentioned in the last episode, because I'm pretty sure they were up late. Um, both Taylor and Aiden, and I didn't think Taylor was going to get up to fix breakfast for, what is happening, um, to fix bre fix lunch for her husband, but she did, she got up, she's, her energy is pretty good. Um, she should be in her third trimester very soon, uh, yeah, in eight hours. Um, I'm not sure, don't think she'll have the baby in this episode, I wish she would. But, um, yeah, so in this episode, I'm not sure what's going to happen. I guess we'll see. I have some ideas. I've been thinking about things while I was busy doing real life things. Don't you hate it when real life gets in the way? But it does, and I have a family, and I have to, they come first. So, yeah, so that's what I've been up to. I've been trying very, very hard to stay. I didn't want you to do that. I wanted you to do that because you have lunch in your pocket. Um, so yeah, I've um, been trying really hard to stay on top of things. I don't want you to eat that because you won't eat your lunch that your wife got up to bake for you. So stop. I stole it from you. Take that. Um, who keeps calling? Who keeps getting phone calls? Is it her? Oh, she needs to work from home. Alrighty, so my cat just was like on our kitchen island and it sounded like she fell off, but she's just so fat. She made such a loud thud when she jumped off the, the island. So yeah, so she is going to work from home today. She needs to clean this dirty sink. It's filthy. She needs to clean that bathtub. So, and I think that's all she needs to clean. So what does she need to do for work today? Um, let's see here. Ooh, he's out of the shower already. I really don't want him to eat a full meal because then he won't eat what she cooked for him. Did he do his work job? Complete, and he needs to raise his charisma. So how about he comes in here and practices his speech until he has to leave for work? All right, and he ate food, so that's not good. But yeah, so what does she need to do? Taylor needs to update social media profile two times. We can do that right now. So we will go to update social media status, and she needs to check in at my Shuno Meadows. Alrighty, that is something we can do. This little guy, little Conrad, is still sleeping. So I need baby names too, because probably, definitely in the next episode, we will be having a baby. So if someone is willing to leave a comment down below, leave comments down below, and I would love baby names. That would be fantastic. I would also love ideas for this Let's Play. That would be fantastic, too. We can make it as dramatic as possible. I love dramatic things. It's like watching a train wreck. You don't want to see it. Oh, God, I did not want to see that. Um, my word, it was like swamp water coming out of her mouth. Why would you splash in that? I'm on the wrong person. I thought Taylor was going to splash in the dirty potty. Oh, my word. Okay. So, yeah. So, like I said, comment down below baby names and also comment down below any ideas you have for this Let's Play. Where do you want it to go? I do have ideas. I think some of them will be coming up soon. Nothing right away. I need to build the stress levels up. I need to build the tension up. But things will be happening. I don't know if it'll be permanent. And you need to go to work. Aye. All right. Get your butt to work. 
and she needs to did she she updated her social media once right yay all right she needs to reach a level three in comedy or mischief can she troll the forums yet that is not a, a grown-up tablet so no on a toddler's tablet you cannot troll the forums but let's see if you can do that on the computer oh I doubt it because she probably has no mischief whatsoever nope awesome that's the easiest way in my opinion to raise your mischief but we will raise comedy by oh no can you raise it by watching comedy channel let's see we'll try it where is that do 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 watch comedy all right so we'll speed through this do 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 do, -do. I think she's gonna go out to lunch with Brian and maybe his significant other, what is his name? I keep forgetting it, Stephen. And maybe they'll hit up my Shuno Meadows together so she can check in there. Um, and, oh, no, she did not level. Okay, whatever. Come up here and social network and update your status once more. And how's this little guy doing? I haven't even checked in on him okay so he's hungry so she can that is the wrong person again way to go Jen okay um food to Conrad and give him some cereal and then he can wake up because I'm happy got along every time I see that that song pops into my head and it really drives me crazy because it was like all last year in my head between people singing it and yes so all right let's put this up because I feel as though a tablet should not be on the ground and he will eat and she can oh maybe he can talk with her talk about princesses don't take him out I have the worst luck with high chairs oh my word I am telling you I don't even know why put him in there I have no luck with them whatsoever whatsoever don't pick him up no do you see this do you see this <laughs> put Conrad here so he can eat his food please do that and don't pick him up again and he should be able to talk to you he's like I, I'm telling you I'm pretty sure I could just sit and listen to him and look at him all day long I don't think I've had much cuter of a toddler <laughs> All right, so now sit down. Leave him be. Thank you. Phew. <laughs> oh, look it. They're having like another love party over there. <laughs> All right. So he will talk to. Can he do that without? Okay. I thought she was going to take him out again. I was like, for real, girl, don't do that. Talk about superheroes. Talk about favorite color. <laughs> Alrighty, so look at her belly. She's cute too. I think she's pretty cute. Yeah, she's pretty cute, but he is like way totally cute. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. And then there's their love party over there. Oh, she's not happy with that. All right, so what does he need now? He is going to need a bath. That would be nice. So when she's done chatting it up with him, give Conrad a bath. What is he? What was that? All right. All right, so we're going to speed through their conversation, which is so cute. All right, she'll give him a bath, and we will clean the dishes for her. We will clean the dishes for her. All right, and then when she's done with that, how is she doing? She's good. She's hungry, but they're going to go. She's going to call and travel with Brian and Steven. Okay. Maybe they'll go to my Shuno Meadows and maybe they'll grill some food, um, hang out. She can check in. She can talk to them, apologize for her husband's behavior. All right, so maybe we should give hugs. So let's hug it out. Let's 
friendly and let's give a welcoming hug which is not anywhere there we go hug why are we hugging okay no and is there there's a grill here somewhere right why would I flirt with him you can't do that okay friendly and in my I had another video my hundred baby challenge it was like two videos ago it wasn't the most recent one it wasn't the speed one it was the one where I talked and I can't hug him okay so um, that's that so she's gonna come over here yep she's chatting with him so in the hundred baby challenge where I talked there was this like mysterious noise I don't know what it was I, I have no clue <laughs> but it was like this banging noise no one was banging I know I had my family was up and about that day but it was like it almost sounded like a spring or something we thought it was the boom arm that holds my microphone but it wasn't I don't know and now I'm petrified that like I don't know my house is haunted or something I have no idea but I do apologize for that noise um, I hope it wasn't too disruptive for anyone who watched that episode so she can go to the bathroom oh look at someone left a big old mess here I don't really want to cook in a kitchen is there a grill of some sort probably not in this part but maybe oh there's the food court there and there's the beer garden can you get food there do 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 order yay okay so let's go here so she's gonna go potty I think I told you to do that all right, so we'll go. Can you go to the freaking toilet, please? <sighs> that, and then we'll order food, and we will order. What does the pregnant lady want? I think she wants French fries. Okay. So let's see where is she? Look at <laughs> waddle 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 walk walk walk. She's so cute. Look at how big her belly is. Maybe she's having twins. Not gonna say it loud because I don't think I want twins. I'm just starting to get over the stress of triplets. Oh my god, they were there and now they're gone. They're running to the spice Hi. festival. Hi. Come here. Where did they go? How do I get them to come back? My word. Can we sit here together? Sit here together. Okay. So she's sitting there. Where did the boys go? Where the boys are. Oh, there they are. Okay. All right. So let's speed it up. Oh, she's going to eat all the fries before they even get there. All right. So first she's going to talk to Steven. She's going to let him know that she's really sorry for the way her husband. Oh, look, he doesn't even want anything to do with her. Oh, look at He's pretty upset with her, too. I think he needs, she needs to use the bathroom. So... She's going to try to butter him up and let him know that what happened between her husband and Brian really had nothing to do with Brian. It had everything to do with her. And he's going to tell her that she's too good to be in that kind of a situation. And I think she agrees, but I think she feels stuck. So she's got, oh, she needs to eat more. She needs to go home and go to sleep. She needs to check in first to get her homework done or her work assignment or whatever all right so let's do that check in do that and then go home let's see if she can even go to sleep when she gets home so that was a horrible flop she didn't even get to talk to Brian which is the one she wanted to talk to I, I hope Brian isn't mad at her we'll see but she needs to go home so go home okay Itchy nose, itchy nose, stuffy nose. I swear, as soon as I start to record, I get stuffy nose. I hate that. Can she waddle a little bit faster, please? Now I saw that Aiden came home. Oh, look at that. He's just standing in the hallway. He got promoted, though, so maybe I should ask him about his day before. And maybe I need to... to embrace him and try to... He's tense. He's, in, he's just not happy with anything right now. I think he truly loves his wife, but he's just not, he's not happy. 
That's that I know for a fact. Oh, look at look at little Aiden on the body. He's such a good boy. Okay, get over it, Jen. All right, go to sleep. Brian is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. Ooh. Oh, I need to sleep though. <laughs> I can't. Sorry. I see he knows something's up. He wanted to talk, and she, you're not napping. You're sleeping. Go to sleep. Aiden's going to have to learn to deal. I think Aiden is going to sit on the computer. He has to not work tomorrow, but I don't think he cares. He's going to sit on the computer and do some more work. Fill out reports. Is that what he has to do now that he fill out reports? Yes. And he has to increase logic. All right. What do you need, buddy? Mr. Avocado shirt. All right. Come here and study your shapes. Why are you crying? potty accident. Well, you have no one to blame but yourself there, Conrad. You should have just sat still and done the pottying without making an accident. You're a level three pottier. You could do that. All right, let's see where his skills are. He's a three. He's a two in movement. Maybe, maybe we should do some blick block, baby. So let's cancel out the blocks. I want to get, I want, so she's going to have the baby, it'll age up to a toddler, and maybe like day one, day two of it being a toddler, we will age Conrad up. Because I do want them to be semi-close in age, regardless of whether or not it's a boy or it's a girl. Because I think what we'll do is if it's a girl, they will share this bedroom and we will make it half a girl's room and half a little boy's room because I feel as though they do need their office. Um, both of them work f from the computer, and I even think that eventually they're going to need okay, to get another so, computer. Oh, what's she waking up for? Okay, so I just sped through a bunch of stuff. He was just on the computer. He's over here playing. She needs to use the bathroom, and I think she's going to notice that it's like almost 11 o'clock and the baby's still up. Stop that, because you're not living up to what I want you to. Um, watch channel, watch Politisim, and you will come in here and realize that your kid is starving, so you will feed him. What is she? What happened? All right, give food to Conrad. It is dinner, so he can have, oh God, can you imagine just eating a bowl full of peas? That's bizarre. All right, cheese and crackers. So put that there, and then he has to stop playing. You can eat in a moment. You can eat in a moment. Can you get your kid, please? Could you please place your child in his high chair. I am telling you. All right. So when you're done doing that, I'm not going to tell you to do anything yet. You sit down. I hate that they stand up and watch TV. <laughs> it's like the hugest pet peeve. All right. And then you will place him there and he will eat and you will not take him out of that chair. So you will come over here and cook some food. You will cook some grilled cheese and go. Do it. Don't fall asleep. You're good. You can make it. That was not good. That would have started a fire. All right. So let's speed through this. Cook, cook, cook. Eat, eat, eat. Oh, wish, I wish we could have gone to the Spice Festival. All right. I promise. As soon as she's done being pregnant and lame, we're going to start doing these things. Okay. So she can do that and sit down, have a conversation. Who's that? have a conversation with your kid so brighten his day and he can talk and raise his <gasps> what is that oh there's a something weird looking like an anteater <laughs> there all right talk about favorite color and talk about toys and talk about not toys again I thought I hit trucks talk about superheroes all right, what are you going to do? 
Are you going to actually do something? I, I will. I'm sorry. I did cancel out the baby thing with him, and I won't. If he wants to, he can. He's hungry, though, so he should come and grab a serving. And where is she in her pregnancy? Maybe we can get it. Any time now. But usually when I'm recording a let's play and they're in their third trimester she doesn't have the baby for like ever and then I'm recording forever all right so what do you need after this you just need to go to sleep so you can read Conrad to sleep stop crying don't worry everything will be okay oh he just wants daddy Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh, the thing. Oh, okay. All right, stop eating. Are you done eating? You're good. So put them down, please, or do something. You look very awkward holding him. <laughs> I think he's a pretty good-looking guy. Do they look alike? They have the same color eyes. Look at, look at Conrad. Oh, ooh. he's like, what are you doing with me? He did look very happy for a minute. Okay, so don't go to bed. Read your child to sleep. Read Conrad to sleep. Or let him keep picking him up. Okay, so we're going to throw away and throw away. And you are going to do this again. Jim, put him to bed then. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, so Aiden, you are going to sleep, and Taylor, okay, you so are going to sleep. We have, I just skipped through their sleeping, and Aiden woke up, and he went and did his business, and we have this broken box here, <coughs> which I've had him try to repair a couple times. I'll have him attempt to repair it once more. And don't go anywhere. Stay in there because when she gets up, she's going to come over and visit. But she's miserable. So she needs to get up and do go about her daily tasks. Take a brisk shower. And the baby's in there. He's playing on his tablet. He literally just woke up. Like I said, I just skipped through their sleeping and Aiden got up and did his stuff and then I started again and I started the recording again so and Aiden needs some food in a little bit but he's good right now so we'll throw the play in there we'll see she's gonna get out of the shower she's going to eat her bra oh she needs to use the bathroom use the just use it oh you cannot wear that outfit I'm sorry <laughs> I am putting a stop to this. Do I have anything? I have that one. Um, yeah. What? Oh, that's her exercise. So you're wearing this outfit. You cannot wear that outfit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right. So she's going to have some breakfast. And there's plenty of food in the fridge. So grab some fruit salad. Okay. So Taylor is going to grab some, oh my word, oh, look at that, you're so proud of yourself, now you can fix this too. Okay, so she's going to grab fruit salad and eat that, Aiden is going to sit here, and she, or she's going to go in to talk to him, one or the other, but she's going to let him know that she's going to go over and have a glass, a, a glass of coffee, yeah, that, because that's what it's called, have a cup of coffee with her neighbors and he's not gonna be happy about it that's for sure so um yeah we'll have to she can't divorce <laughs> she is going to argue about parenting okay oh my word oh <gasps> This is so exciting. I just can't stand it. She is not going to do any of that. She is going to have the baby. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. Aiden needs food, right? First, yes. So let's not put him in his high chair. Oh, calm down. Let's take out some fruit salad for you, Aiden, and come over and grab a serving. Where are you going? 
Are you going to go tell Brian you're in labor? She just can't even stand it. She just had to walk out. Okay, she needs to go to the hospital. Have baby at hospital. I prefer having the babies at the hospital because all their needs go up when they're done. And that is fantastic. And in the 100 baby challenge that I have, I just read that it's okay to have the baby at the hospital. I am doing it every time because I think that's the only way that I'll make my lady in that challenge happy. So I'm excited. I am so excited about that. So yeah. And you should totally watch that Let's Play or that challenge because it's so funny. I can't even, there's not, it's just, it's, it's like tragic. <laughs> so, but so isn't their relationship. So it's that. So yes. Um, so she is checking in at the front desk. Come on. So what do we think she's going to have? And I don't have any idea for baby's names whatsoever. So we have Conrad. Should we stick with the C's? I don't know. I'm not sure. Where is she going to go? All right. So funny thing, and I don't know if I've said this before. I tend to repeat stories, even in real life I do. But there was one time when I always have the baby in this room. One time, the first time I ever had the baby in this room over here, the doctor came in and then left. And I had to get up in the middle of my labor and walk to the other room. I thought that was and another doctor came in. I found that so bizarre. Never happened again. Has only happened once. I was like, what is going on? All right, so we're going to deliver her heart. And then we're going to squirt in some more Elmer's glue. And it's a boy, which means we will have another baby. Okay, but we won't tell Aiden that. All right, so what do we want to name the boy? We have a Conrad. How about... Let's go through some of these names. Not Blaze. <laughs> Chester, Sawyer. Blake is cute. I like Blake. Hmm. Terrence, Sam, Frank, Ashley, Zachariah, Todd, Jean, Emmett... I like Blake. All right, so we're going to go back. All righty, so we are going to be mommy to another boy of the name Blake O'Neill. Is it just one? Please just be one. Come on, machine, push away. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. I get so nervous. All right. Yay, I'm so excited. Aiden, you can come in. <clears throat> okay, so we are going to head home, and that will probably be the end of this episode. Um, it did end rather excitingly. Um, we had our little boy. We'll see how everyone deals with all this, the extra, how Taylor deals with the extra stress of another baby. Ooh, she's going to drink some water first, though. Um, but yeah, so... I hope you guys all are enjoying this. I know there's some down parts, but like in every Sims Let's Play, not all of it can be super duper exciting. But I do have things that are going to happen in their relationship. Um, we need to figure out how they're going to be able to afford these two kids. I don't think that Taylor's going to be able to continue working, in all honesty. And, um... <clears throat> yeah, and I think that um, our little Conrad may act out. Um, oh, I just threw away a whole bowl. <laughs> Yay, Jen. So, yeah, so I think our little Conrad may act out with the, tot the new baby around. Um, I'm not sure. I know of the pair now that I have two boys. I know I want one to be like the perfect little cookie cutter and the other one to be like the like terror um, so I'm not sure which one yet. Conrad seems to kind of already solidified himself in the good boy, but we'll see. Um, 
but yeah, so I do have ideas. I know what's going to happen and there may be something big happening in the next episode. So stay tuned to that. But I hope you guys all are enjoying this and please, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. And yeah, I'll see you in my next episode, everyone. Bye bye. Hey guys, it's Omni Simmer here, and I really hope you enjoyed watching my latest episode. If you enjoyed watching, give it a big old thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more videos like this one, click on the link to the side. I'll see you in my next video, guys. Bye-bye.